that is day four of being in quarantine and my brother he seems to be having symptoms so i have to check his temperature yes i have a bag over my head and a mask but you have to do what you have to do all right. Bring your ear. You got it. Yeah, here you go. You, you giving it back to me? I'm wiping it. He has the yeah. Rona. I don't need it. I got it wiped down. Thank you. Mm -hmm. He has the Rona. His temperature is 101.2. Go ahead and so everybody in the house has the Rona. He's experiencing symptoms. I'm sorry, y'all probably not taking me seriously. Let me take this thing off. I'm sorry. My mom is telling him about the experience that she has gone through with the coronavirus and she's helping him through it. And he has to go to the doctors. He also has to get a test taken. Um, my mom wiped the thermometer off for me and Judah because we do need it for us, for our safety, because we have to keep checking Judah's temperature around the clock. So, everybody in the house has the Rona, but Judah and I, as of now, guys, this is like really scary. What time is it? It is day four and it is seven, seven twenty-four in the morning. My brother's temperature was 101.5. Um, Judah's temperature was 97.7. And my temperature is 98.5. Last night, I checked my temperature. And my temperature was 99. Yeah, it was 99.7. So, it was 99.7 and 99.5. So... So my mom is telling me to do Walmart makeup again. I know that's kind of bad, but um, she wants me to go get some orange juice and ginger ale because as you guys know, you said Dollar General? You can't go. So we, y'all, we just need medicine and like, this is too much. I just never thought it would be like this bad. Like, it's a possibility that we all have it. It's just simple. Like, <sighs> so everybody in the house needs to be taking medicine. My brother is experiencing chills. He has like a fever. And whenever I was putting a thing to his ear, you could feel like the heat from his body hit my hand. And the day just started. Guys, we are spraying, we are sanitizing, we are just making sure everything is clean for the next person. Y'all, we are taking this thing like, I don't know. We're trying our best to not spread it to each other, but it's still like happening for some reason.
you know i'm sorry i look like this i literally just woke up i just wanted to update you guys on everything so judah and i are headed to the airport to get tested for covid As judah is in his seat he's still sleeping i had to get him dressed really quickly so we can get tested oh my gosh i am so hot y'all please excuse my car i haven't had time to clean it lately but where are my glasses <laughs> these are dirty Ugh. All right, these are a little bit better. They'll help me get to my destination. But okay, guys, me and Judah are headed to the airport to get tested. Um, we were in the room and my mom texted me and she told me that my brother's results, they um, came in. And I'm not sure if I um, put the vlog out where we tested my brother one morning like early one morning because he was experiencing like a lot of the symptoms mm. but um he was experiencing a lot of the symptoms and we test him and his his temperature was over 100 so my mom rushed him to the airport to get tested they, they set an appointment and they went to the airport to get tested and his results came back in i was laying in bed me and judah and she texted me and the results came back positive so she was like oh my gosh y'all need to go get tested um set an appointment up um download the app at the testing site so i downloaded the app scheduled an appointment um we have an appointment at 3 30 and it is three o'clock it's three o'clock right now we have 30 minutes to get there it takes about 15 20 minutes to get from here to the airport from my house and we are on the way i think my mom called the uh some kind of dhec place or something and they told her that we me and judah we just needed to go ahead and get tested guys i'm going to try to vlog the testing process if i can uh oh my gosh this is like so crazy like we aren't experiencing any symptoms we've been keeping up with our temperatures well we might have been experiencing symptoms but i can't like really feel it like i told y'all i have migraines all the time so headaches to me is kind of a normal thing and then my temperature was a little high in one of the logs but it went back down like my body is like fighting off the uh the virus but i don't know someone told me that my body could be fighting off the virus but i don't know um i'm kind of nervous i took judah's temperature before we left the house his temperature was 97 point 97.5 wasn't bad at all i didn't take my temperature but i feel kind of warm because i'm panicking i guess i don't know I'm just like my ears are a little tingly like I'm kind of nervous about taking this test because dude if we have COVID oh my gosh that's kind of weird well not weird but it's just shocking but um we're gonna go ahead and travel to the airport and whenever we get there I'll turn the camera back on and I'll like I said, I'll try my best to get it on camera. I'm going to have to take Judah out of his car seat to get his test done. Oh my gosh, I feel bad for him because they're going to have to stick that thing up his nose. What is wrong? What? Why does my car sound like that? Maybe because I didn't own, leave it on for a long time to warm up. But I feel bad for the little baby. He has to get his little test done. Oh, Judah, it'll be fine. Judah, it's okay. But yeah, I'm gonna go now and I'll turn the camera back on whenever we get there. Why does my car sound like that? <sighs> okay. 
Hey guys, I am pulling into the airport. I think I made a wrong turn, but I'm gonna figure this out. <laughs> um, I don't know exactly where to go. It didn't give specific uh, directions. It just said the airport, so. Ah! Okay, don't think this is like weird or anything, but y'all know how like whenever you're about to do something and, and like you're really nervous and then you have to go to the bathroom, not pee, but the other thing. <laughs> That's how I feel right now. Like I have to go to the bathroom, like I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> um what the heck all right i'm gonna go look at my uh email and see if they gave me direct oh okay okay i got it mm -hmm. i'm literally Eddie's here Street toward terminal drive. and it says two minutes so this is terminal drive Oh, y'all, I see the sight. I see the sight. Got my eyes on you. Turn left onto Gilbert Avenue. Wow. Do we get out? Like, how does this work? Mm, it says right. Okay, so I want to make sure that I'm vlogging real quick. So let me check this camera real quick and then I'll turn y'all back on. 